Welcome to the Squirrel Fun Channel. Remember to subscribe and give us a thumbs up. Thomas Edison popularized the incandescent light bulb, but he didn't invent it. In fact, there were many inventors of the light bulb who came before Edison. It turns out that passing current through a filament to create incandescent light was the easy part. The more difficult task was finding a long-lasting, cost-effective design for light bulbs. The history of the light bulb's invention is one of the many is one of many inventors pursuing the same goal through a variety of different means, but falling short because of technical and business problems. Edison gets credit because he had the right match of technical skill and business acumen to illuminate the world. Sir Humphrey Davy Davy created what is generally considered to be the first incandescent light in 1802 by passing electric current through a strip of platinum. In 1809, he created an arc lamp by connecting two wires to a battery and attaching a charcoal strip between the other ends of the wires. This was the first miner's safety lamp, which could provide illumination even in the presence of flammable, flammable gas. Warren Delarue a British astronomer and chemist, Delarue created the first light bulb in 1820 by passing an electric current through a platinum coil in a vacuum tube. Despite its effectiveness, the cost of the platinum made his invention impractical for commercial use. James Bowman Lindsay Lindsay is said to have demonstrated an electric lamp at a public meeting in Dundee, Scotland in 1835. However, his claims are not well documented and he did not develop the device further. His innovation used powdered charcoal between two platinum wires contained in a vacuum bulb. Frederick de Molines. In 1841, Englishman Frederick de Molines was granted the first patent for an incandescent bulb. He used powdered charcoal heated between two platinum wires, and his idea was a success. John Wellington Starr. In 1845, American John Wellington Starr acquired a British patent through his agent, Edward Augustine King, for an incandescent bulb that used carbon filaments. Alexander Lodigan Lodigan acquired a patent in Russia for the incandescent light bulb in 1874. He later moved to the U.S. and acquired patents for incandescent bulbs with different filaments. His light bulb with a molybdenum filament was demonstrated at the World's Fair in Paris in 1900. Henry Woodward and Matthew Evans In 1874, Woodward and Evans designed and patented an incandescent light bulb in Canada. They attempted to commercialize their invention, but were unsuccessful, and eventually sold their patent to Edison. William Sawyer Sawyer developed a lighting apparatus in 1877 and founded a company with Albon Mann to produce incandescent lamps. He successfully defended his patents against the Edison Company and secured a contract with Westinghouse to use his apparatus 
to light the Chicago World's Fair in 1893. Lewis Howard Latimer Latimer worked for another light bulb pioneer, Hiram S. Maxim, and patented a carbon filament that enabled the light bulb to burn longer. Edison eventually purchased the patent and hired Latimer in 1884. He also created the threaded socket that allows a light bulb to fit into the fixture. Heinrich Goebel A controversial figure in the history of lighting, Goebel, who was originally from Germany but later moved to New York, claimed to have created working incandescent bulbs in the 1850s, prior to Edison's inventions. In 1893, lawyers for three light bulb manufacturers who were sued by Edison Electric Light Company used the so-called Goebel defense to assert that Edison's patents were void because his invention was not novel. The courts found it was extremely improbable that Goebel had created a practical bulb in the 1850s, and Goebel could not produce any of the devices. Goebel was granted several patents for his later light bulb innovations, but Edison declined to buy them. Joseph Swan Swan patented his invention for the incandescent light bulb in 1878 in England. By 1881, he had started the Swan Electric Lamp Company and began commercial production. Because they were developing similar patents around the same time, the Edison and Swan companies merged into the Edison and Swan United Electric Company. However, Edison eventually acquired all of Swan's interest in the company, and Swan sold his patent rights to the Brush Electric Company in 1882. Thomas Alva Edison The light bulbs created prior to Edison's experiments tended to be expensive and short-lived. Edison's insight was to create long-lasting bulbs in a vacuum that were commercially viable. Still, there were many court battles in the years immediately following the granting of his January 1880 patent, and he formed a joint company with Joseph Swan called Ediswan to avoid a court battle with the British inventor. Edison's electric lamp patent, number 223898, was issued January 27, 1880. Although Edison's light bulb became the first commercially viable electric lamp in the United States, the technology took decades to become widely used. In 1925, 45 years after Edison patented his light bulb, only 25% of the U.S. population used electric lighting.